everyone of Keychain. This is my footage for Kingdom Raid from the weekend after Easter of 2021. So here we had Kingdom 52, 273, and 420. Now we've had these kingdoms multiple times in the past, so there were lots of bubbles going around and it was really hard to find targets. So I ended up doing some things that I normally don't. Um, I was going after much bigger players than I'm normally comfortable with and burning through speed ups like crazy to try and speed hit players when I find them. So the first one on the list is a speed hit. Now this guy's got big friends and here it may, it's said that I was defeated um, just barely but I only lost 318,000 um, took out just about 2 million of his troops. So I was going to pour it in and hit him again. He's out of there. But I know I need to move because he's got big friends. So um, as immediately right here, I find a spot out in the middle of nowhere, and I'm pre-planning my port. And you'll see my screen lights up red right as I'm getting ready to port. So somebody was coming, um, and I don't know who it was. I don't know if someone from his kingdom, and he put it in kingdom chat, or if it was someone from his alliance, but I was out of there. So, successful hit on this one, and let's get into the next set. So here I found lower level troops, um, but still, it's a million troops, so I was all for it. Now, this is a hive that I've kept bookmarked for a long time because we fight these guys so often. I mean, it must be the like, sixth or seventh time that we fought Kingdom 420, so... I don't even delete my bookmarks for a lot of these kingdoms that we face all the time anymore. I just you know, keep them and, and stack over the top. Now here, what did I find? Um, this was my next port in. This one, I th think... I don't remember which kingdom this one actually is. Um, but you'll see quite a few times in here that I broke Peace Shield when I found some targets and I was after some people. So here we got a million troops in the first set. Um, total troops, 3.4 million. So we're going to keep attacking and keep getting the rest of these troops. And some of these hives I've visited multiple times as, you know, we found targets and, you know, someone who I hit previously may be shielded again and one of his friends um, or her friends will be unshielded. So I'm not quite strong enough here that I can wipe out 3 million troops in one hit so um, you know it took multiple hits and the other thing that I try and edit out as much as I can is I scout a lot I, I send scouts to everybody around I'm looking for resources I'm looking for um, you know hidden gems amongst the little castles I don't usually go after small amounts of troops um, like if there's a castle 22 and it has 80,000 troops I don't usually bother with that but if it has 80,000 troops and 10 million resources, then I'll send a march for it. So um, that's my main goal during Kingdom Raid is resources. And this one was kind of disappointing for that overall. Not horrible, but hasn't been like the last few that I published where I had, you know, 500 million resources and, and that type of stuff. So this one, I'm after this C41, and you'll see that a lot in this video is that I was up against C41s or C42s because they're just, they're older kingdoms. There's a lot more resources sitting around, there's a lot of speed ups, and people were, were waiting for this. So um, luckily I, I didn't run into too many huge walls, um, I didn't sacrifice ridiculous amounts of troops, but um, there were some that could have been better. And this guy um, just happened to be one of my bookmarks that I found. So, lucky him. <laughs> and there were, there were quite a few people in um, Kingdom 52 that had bookmarks for me, but not that I would have been able to attack them. Um, I had a bunch of 2 and 3 and 4 billion power players bookmarked so that I could try and find somebody to hit them and get the points and maybe tag along if there's resources. Because you'll notice 
as you get higher up in the game, um, the big players have big resources, and it's because they can take it from smaller players, or they've been playing for a long time, and some of them, when they have 10 or 15 million troops, they think they're invincible, and that, you know, they can hold open millions or billions of resources. And that's typically where someone like Dark comes in, proves them wrong, and then we get to get in on the action and loot the resources after the fact. So here, his farm and his main had a lot of resources. So of course I'm gonna go for the farm first. Um, we'll get the kills out of there and then I'll just spam send all of my you know, marches. Um, and these are not my marches, they're just whatever the game presets. When I'm trying to fast um, or quick send, I just, you know, attack and send, attack and send. And then here I decided to try and fight Lancelot. Now he had 4.7 million troops, and I was hoping that maybe he, you know, left the wrong gear on. Um, this first hit wasn't horrible. Um, I killed a million, lost 600,000. Um, but I was thinking, well, it was in my favor, so the next hit should be better. And here's the second hit. Now, after the second hit, um, in about five seconds here, <laughs> you'll see that I am going to abandon this, um, this attack. Um, the second attack, I lost more than I killed. And then at that point, it becomes not worth it to me. Um, I don't want to lose more troops than I'm killing. And I probably could have figured out a way to make those marches better or change some things up. But there's also a whole bunch of massive players in Kingdom 52, like Sasha, um, Nico, who else? Some other ones. Um, and then some of the big players from the other kingdoms that are maxed out route hunting. So, oh, Troll is a big one from Kingdom 52. There's there's a lot. So hanging around in the kingdom and, and trying to maximize marches or find ways to, to kill people, um, not something I really wanted to be doing. So here was the report. Our stats were close. He just he had too many troops for me to attack into. Here's another one I had bookmarked sitting out um, kind of by himself and I checked him many times throughout this and finally found him with his shield down so I was able to get these troops. Um, I did go back for the second hit and finish off that last little bit of troops but I didn't show that here. Now here I think is the third time and see our little buddy Lancelot right there to the right. Um, this is well later in the day. Um, that this guy Toke um, had his shield drop. So I came back and I don't know if anybody hit Lancelot at this point, um, but I know somebody did before the raid was over because I checked on him again and he was down at like 450 million power. So somebody definitely got him before raid was over. So this one was 1.2 million kills and second hit coming up. Now, I know some of you have asked this before, why I send only cavalry. Um, I do need to reformat my marches a little bit. Um, I prefer cavalry for longer marches, but most of the ones here I was able to get right up next to them. Oh, and check out this party. <laughs> Look at this power party in the middle. They had a lot of big power players hanging out. Uh, I think they were doing some type of group photo. So I took the opportunity to kill people around them while they were busy doing other stuff. Um, so this guy had 1.3 million troops. Uh, I got most of them in the first shot and then I'll follow up and, and finish it off. And that seems to be the theme um, with a lot of these little hits is, you know, they have just barely more than I can kill in one shot and then I go back and finish them off after. Um, this guy had resources, so spam sending my little leprechauns to go and collect um, gold, silver, and other resources for me. Now this one, um, this was in the MSK Hive, and Arya Stark has hit me before and wrecked me. <laughs> uh, 
uh, I think it was the last raid. Um, I got hit pretty early on, and I survived the hit, but, you know, definitely lost way more than I killed. And I'm always kind of on edge when I'm in someone's hive, and I know that they have big players. So, you know, doing the best I can here to be ready to jump in case somebody comes. And that's been, you know, kind of the theme when we're facing these kingdoms with massive maxed out players is I need to be careful. So here, screen flashing red, um, I poured out and then immediately, as soon as you port the first one, you got to random away. Um, that was, you know, luckily they didn't speed it in and then I speed back over and I find out it was dark. He's just messing with me. Um, so I port back in to finish off the troops that Goku had. And this was, I think the last attack of the raid. Um, and it was pretty fun. I ended up with, you know, 130 million resources and, uh, 1.9 billion points. So that's quite a few kills. Um, I don't have the exact number, but I will before I publish the video, so I'll put it in the comments. Um, so I think that's it. Thank you for watching. Uh, remember to hit the like button and the subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.